Smartware can be used in multiple configurations, including with a data logger or performance instrumentation. In this video, we're going to discuss using the Smartware in a standalone configuration. When using the Smartware as a standalone device in the vehicle, you'll run the positive battery cable to the quarter inch stud located at the top of the unit. You will use the two 23 pin connectors for your inputs, hardwired inputs and your outputs. You will use the USB port for programming the device. You will use the switch input connector if you decide to use the switch panel or switch module. You will not use the VNet port for this application. When using the SmartWire device as a standalone unit, you have three options for switch inputs. You can use the hardwired inputs on the two 23 pin connectors. There's six each for a total of 12. You can use the optional switch panel or the optional switch module, which you would use if you have existing switches in the vehicle you'd like to retain. The switch module and panel can be connected together, daisy chained with a single cable for a variety of options. The limitation is two devices on the switch input connector of the SmartWire device. You can mix and match those two, either two switch panels, two switch modules, or one of each. Again, all connected with a single cable between these and the device. Once you have all the devices mounted in the vehicle and wired together, you'll install the DataLink 2 software included in the kit. Once the software is installed, you'll take the supplied USB cable, plug in the mini USB cable to this end, and then plug in to your PC and start the programming process. From there, you will assign names to the switch inputs that correlate with the devices they are powering and start programming them to switch on and off based off of the switch positions in the panel or switch options in the module. If you'd like to learn more about programming the SmartWire as a standalone device or have any other questions about it, please visit racepacksmartwire.com.